What up? We're doing this. CDL week five. So now you're gonna see something. This team is literally the exact same team from last week. Changed some stuff up. Like I have for the move, like Oosphere and Sunny Day, Heat Lock for Gorgian Fire. And that's because this team was the team I was talking about why I built for the one guy. <laughs> But now I know I built for the right guy. This is the six we think he's booing in. Um, it's pretty funny how I, uh, you know. So you might even expect these six. We'll see though. Uh, this is six we think he's booing in. I'll show his team real quick. Structure, Blissing, Glade, Fortress, Weavile, Silicon Galai, Whimsicott, Suicune, Oikorio, Sandslash, Retail, Oikorio, Sandslash, Suicune. I'm trying to hurry up here because we are actually a day overdue. So, and that's just oh, okay. Good luck, have fun. So no sloking's really nice, and no Gallade's incredibly nice. Um, Oikoyo, Oikoyo, Pom Pom, and. Whimsicott. So it's probably gonna be like Specs Whimsicott, and that's the six. Uh, let me get the live link going. Uh, this is definitely a scary six. I mean, I definitely saw Blissey and Suicune coming. I just didn't know what the last of his bulk would have been. I don't know if it's gonna be Slow King. I don't know if it's gonna be um, what's it called? Like I don't know, maybe more offensive support with Whimsicott. So we'll see. <sighs> Oh. So, starters here, I don't see a man that threatens Okie Doggy, like at all. Maybe it's Oikoyo? But I'm gonna lead it. Um. Now. I did. I have ran AP twice on V Nicholas. Um. Um, so I'm not just gonna make the Unicolus my mon that I'm bluffing. As he leads Weavile, this is an amazing lead. This is low-key an amazing lead. Okie doggy into Weavile. He's doing 40% well. I could just straight up kill him. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to Terra Fairy here. And I'm going to knock off. He's staying in. As he knocks off. Wait, that's wild he did that. Okay, well, we get the toxic chain off and he's knock off. He did how much? It was real. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love that. The realization of, oh shit. <laughs> it ain't the Zorak. That's because I've led Zorak every match so far. Um, so that's one thing I was trying to bait. He ain't staying in here now. Why are you crazy? Okay, fine. We're drain punching now. You're crazy, my man. And he did knock off my lefties. Um, I'm going straight into Donatello, honestly. I know he's staying in now. If I stayed in and then killed Wuvario, I can like almost win the game on the spot. This is only Mon threatening my team. Only Mon that threatens uh, like literally half a Mon's. Because the Unicles could take a Shadow Ball and kill in return, depending on my moveset. And if I'm AV, I wall you. And now- NOW YOU SWAP! I HATE THIS MAN! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Calm down. Triple Axel. Knock off. He was Axel Bell, but he's no longer. Whimsicott is usually like Specs. I don't really have a great Whimsicott check. Maybe the Uniclus. Um, I actually didn't really expect Wim to come, as he does just Moonblast do 31%. That is definitely choice specs, my guy. Choice specs? Uh, the pretty- m yeah, that's like max special attack choice specs. Um, so what I'm going to do- oh, do I go for it now? I think he's gonna- he's either gonna send in Weavile, or he's just gonna stay in. I think I'm gonna sunny day up. Yeah! Okay. I could have went for the focus blast and killed them there, but you know, now we know he's specs. That's good info. Um, choice specs. Specs into moon blast. Um, and we also, since Donatello is full HP, we are not worried at whatever he does here. 
I think he just goes for knockoff. That's fine. Gets out of our heavy duty. We've always doing a lot, but I kind of expected this. Um, his switch into this is probably going to be Wim. So I want to make an aggressive double, but I'm going to say, I, oh, I'm going to say he might just stay in and Weavile's dead, which is massive. I'm not going to lie. That's really big. That is massive. Really, really big there. <clears throat> Weavile is a mon that was super threatening as this comes out. Okay. Um, Spectrier. Um, I know this guy likes to play super aggressive, so he might just go. Sh he might just do the Dark Pulse into um, Zorak, which I want to check how much that's doing. Forty percent. So we always live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's fine. It's always fine. We can always just do this once. We can always do this once. And if he goes for like uh, like an Aspot or something, it's fine with us. If he goes for Psychic, he now knows he's Psychic though. Psychic. Okay, okay. Psychic Spectre. How much is that doing? 24%? Hold on, let's check. Yeah, so he could be like lefties or something. Um... I'm gonna flame here. Yeah! Let's go! Die! I was like, okay, he's either gonna go for Wimscraft for an aggressive because he's playing super aggressive here. Or, <laughs> yeah, I love this guy. Or he's gonna go into Blissey, which I only need a little bit of chip before I'm good to go. Um, okay, Sukun comes out. It's okay, we're gonna go straight into this. Sun is still up for three more turns or two more turns as he goes for the Scald. And we are gonna trick whatever comes in. If it's Blissey, that's fine. If it's this Oyakoyo, that's fine. No matter what here, yeah, let's go. We take that. We take that. We super take that. That's exactly what we wanted. We're not gonna click for cover. Uh, he might go straight into the Spectra. Hmm. How much is Spectra ticking to the Unicolus? 54%. I'm just gonna go for the Psy Shock. Yep, that's nice for me. That's fine with me. Nice 46%. We'll take that. You're now in range for Riku. Um, I think he's too scared of this coming out, so I'm gonna be super aggressive here. I'm gonna be super aggressive here. <gasps> oh, he does have Dark Pulse. Okay, 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 okay. It's okay because plus one Zoic always lives, and do I need this anymore? I do not need this anymore. I sack this. Do I live at plus one? Oh my god, do I live at plus one? Zoic. Dark Pulse. 70%. I should always live this. I'm gonna U-turn out. Yep, that's fine with me. As I am going to go for the DD, honestly. Yeah, this is fine with me. I'm gonna go for DD. Are you gonna go for Toxic? Thunder Wave. Ah, okay, okay. I'm just gonna go for DD again. If he just goes for Cyclic Toss, I'm gonna go for DD again. <laughs> What are we doing? Okay, so... <laughs> what? I'm what? <laughs> That's some coolest stick, I'm not gonna lie though. Um, I do have speed, um, uh, payload, hold on, I need to check everything. Spectre, Spectre does outspeed me, I'm going for the DD again. Okay, so we're plus four now. Into Suicune. This is definitely like gonna be max defense, but Earthquake is still doing a shit ton to this. Yeah, 60%. As he roars out, that's fine with me. That's fine with me. Um, he's just gonna, yeah, this is him. Okay. He has no way to break Simba anymore. Um, no way to break Simba. He has no way to break re uh, actual floor just either. So I'm just trying to think on like, on like what exactly I'm gonna do here. Because I'm scared of Oikoyo coming out, and Oikoyo's terrors are, um... Oh, let's kill Suicune, that's super nice. Oikoyo's terrors are flying grass ground, so he could be terror ground into my Simba. This is tough. I think I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna do Simba, because it's kind of forces Spectre. I think. Or oh, it forces Oikoyo, yeah, 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 okay, okay, okay. Oikoyo, so Oikoyo 
Pow? I think this is what it's on. This is Pom Pom, maybe? Which one is this? Pom Pom. Koi Koyo Pom Pom. He crash at neutral's doing 88%. I think it goes for the quiver. That's fine with me. We go for it again. He has to he has to go for the pair. No pair. No pair and we're good to go. Actually, even with pair, I think we're fine. He might just try to root. He can't root spam. He's here at ground. Oh, he kills! Plus one, you kill? What? Oh, this guy's like max special attack. Okay, 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 okay wait a minute. Right. It says I should always live this. It says I should always live this, and I can go... Oh, but then Spectre becomes scary. Spectre becomes scary. I should have went into the... Oh, I should have went to the right mon. I should have went to the right mon. Could I do this and Spectre... Can't break floor just... It's fine, it's fine. I think it's supposed to death draw. That's amazing! Okay, that's really fine with me. That's really fine with me. Super fine with me. Come on. Come on. Counter sweep time? No, I got to check out. This thing. Hey, we take those, we take those. That's fine with me. That's fine with me, my guy. The only reason why I'm saying that's fine with me, because if he, uh, okay, so he had to be max, max special attack. And if he isn't max, max special attack, there is a very low percent chance it killed Gordon Fire. So he either is max, max special attack and it didn't matter, or he isn't, and he just got incredibly lucky. And we live that. Perfect. And then, of course, Spectre is going to come out. Because why the fuck isn't he going to? Yeah. Um, so I got to look at Forgers now. Forgers into Spectre. So I know he's, it could be Shadow Ball, Draining, he's Psychic. And he is Dark Pulse. We can't do anything to this. As he goes for Psychic, doing yum 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 8%. Okay. So we're gonna wish up here. That's fine with me, and we can we can kill this Moon Blast. I'm not even in this league. <laughs> oh my god, that's amazing. Um. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna f wish again. As he his only way to hurt Zoic is Seismic Toss. So he's gonna go for the Thunder Wave here. Yeah. Good play on his end. Good play on his end. But I don't care. I'm gonna go for the Brick Brick now. Show him the tech. Immune. Bop. Crit. Um, so now you can go for Endeavor here. And because of that, I kind of... Uh, I want to sack. Do I need a sack? I don't need a sack. I just go do this. Oh, he soft boils up. Okay, well, I'm going to Drain Punch here. Um, nom, 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 nom. Then, uh, knock off. Okay, that's fine. Blissey's dead, and now it's just Spectre. It's 2%. Um, does... Do we live one? Okie doggy Terra Fairy. So we always live here, it says. Yeah, let's go. GG's. We take those. 4-0. Okie doggy grabbing those kills. Um, I actually think they might put him in, in um, on the kill leaderboard. He was really close to being in top three kill leaderboard. He was like three, two kills off, so. GG's. Um, I was, I'm not gonna lie, super scared of that. Matt, negative. Leo, <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> You played well. You played well. My team was good. Into you. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> um. Yeah, my team was really good into him. Kind of. I'm like in two other ones where I'm doing okay low. <clears throat> Best of luck. Best of luck in those. Um. But yeah, like, you know, I have Okie Doggy. That's an amazing Suikun check. Um. We don't have a great Wii Watch. I actually really thought, um, what's it called? You too. Um, what's it called? I really thought he would be, like, Banded Weavile, because Banded Weavile, once he gets a knockoff off, once, once on Blastoise, I no longer have a check. That's how scared I was of Weavile. We 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 I can't fucking speak. Weavile. So, it was one of those things where it's like, holy crap.
please don't be banded. If it's banded, it's scary. That's why I was so happy that he just let me knock off the item. And that's why I wasn't my um I wasn't upset about the turn one. I was why it's why he stayed in turn two. Mainly because I could have just snagged that kill and he has no offensive walk. Like, he actually he has um Quiver Dance Pom Pom, which by the I still had Gorgian Fire around. I still had all these mods around, so it wasn't hard. And plus once he tailored ground and my blastoids with decent HP if I could wish it back up. There's no physical way of him breaking out of that even with pom pom. So oh that is the wrong thing. Um but yeah. So GG's to my opponent. We're looking really good in this league. Uh I want to um show off how well we are doing. So here let's pull this up. So this was his team. Um our team is, I think this one, CCT. Yeah, so we're three and one. We're now four and one. Counting that match, I haven't counted yet. And our plus seven diff is now going to like what? Oh, wait, hold up. That uh, little <laughs> notification of that should have been working. Yep, but now we're at plus 10 diff with four and one. Um, I think it's like Okie Dog, it was 10 kills. Hold on. I want to look at the standings. Just say standings. We're right now second place, which is really nice. This guy's going off with his Diancy. So, and Okie, okay, let's go! Okie okay, doggy made it to the top three! Oh, that's awesome. Good for my mans. We need to try to get more kills with him. Because he's gaming right now, and we need to make him keep gaming. Um, But, uh, yeah. GG's to my opponent. I think he did play really well, and I think he, he played really aggressive. And I think that's exactly how he should have played into my team. Like, expecting defensive blastoids, which I have always bung this week. I'm hoping next week I can bring, like, a super offensive one, change it up. Um, of course, Florges, we have Unicliss. Like, we have so much bulk. And not to mention that if, of course, if you expected AV Zoric, AV Zoric is, you know, I think... And that now walls his entire team, basically, except Weavile. So it makes sense why he was playing super aggressive there, trying to get rid of items, trying to get rid of any way to just, like, whittle me down for certain mods, like Pom Pom, to get up. So I think he played great. Um, and yeah, I mean, let's go. I'm hoping, I'm hoping Gorgian Fire <laughs> can snag some more kills. I actually think Gorgian Fire has been incredibly helpful in this league. Like, yeah, sh sure, he got Vord out, right? And basically did no kills. But we needed that chip on Suicune because Suicune could have legitimately 1v1'd our entire team. So, with Rest, you know, Roar, he, he was clearly Calm Mind, Roar, Rest, and Scald. So, it was like, he could have, if I didn't get the Sticky Barb off, or even if he just played incredibly well, he could have beat me 1v1 with that Suicune. I have gotten Reverse Swept in Monarchs multiple times when I got the Sticky Barb off, it's just him, like, low mid-HP. It just, like, I couldn't, you know. But that was actually good, I was able to get that kill. Um, I don't think it was just Gorgian Fire was it there to force Terror, which is another big thing. If I could force Terror with that Pom Pom, that means he no longer has the electric, t um, coverage. Because if you don't know how Revelation works, Revelation Dance, it goes by, uh, typing. So once he turned Terror ground, his Revelation Dance was no longer electric, it became, um, ground. So the only moves he had was ground flying, I think he gets another coverage, but it's not good. So it was one of those things that's like, once he turns ground, blast all his walls, and I could wish up. Um, and then they were saying with certain other mons here, so. Yeah. <clears throat> GG's, and I, I'm gonna end it here. And I'll see you guys next week. Well, let's hope we can keep this winning. <laughs> Later.